Hi, this is Mike from Mike's Unboxing Reviews Now 2, and today I'm going to talk to you about problems with firmware with the Xiaomi Defang. Keep watching to find out more. Okay, so if you've got a Xiaomi Defang camera and you've done the latest firmware update, uh, which is 5.5.1.391, this particular update seems to be quite problematic. Uh, I've got three of these cameras in my house and two of the three have all failed on this update. Now the update is, uh, I think it's dated roughly October 27th, 2018. So um, this is specific to that particular firmware, but obviously firmwares are very similar. So if you're having problems with other firmwares or other updates, then this also applies. Now, the first thing is, uh, I did the update on all three cameras and most of them have gone through a stage of rebooting numerous times after the update which immediately started to ring uh, alarm bells and something wasn't quite right. Now uh, two of the devices actually settled down and are still completely working fine but one of the devices, this one, not so good. So I went through the normal procedure of pressing the reset button, try and reconnect, and then I did the uh, firmware reset. So you press and hold the button for like 10 to 15 seconds to wait for it to completely reset, then go through the setup. But initially I was finding that the device wouldn't uh, be found by the Xiaomi app. So if you go into uh, manually add, you could add to the fan camera, but it wouldn't actually see it and it wouldn't actually program it. And if you go into the uh, cameras near me section, it would scan and it would find no camera. So I did this a couple of times and with no joy, and I thought, well, let's look, look a little bit deeper. So I thought, well, maybe the actual firmware is corrupted, or the SD card. So I have took out the SD card from the camera, which is uh, one of these, a verbatim. Now I've got the same uh, cards in all three cameras, so uh, and they're all roughly the same age. So I don't think it was a faulty card, but I took the card out, stick it into the card reader using my uh, Ugreen USB 3 card reader, and the actual Windows Explorer immediately found a problem with the card. And also when I opened up the, the directory, there was a lot of weird looking uh, letters and digits on the folder. So it looks like there was some kind of corruption. So that appears to be what has happened. So if you're having a similar problem with your Xiaomi camera, where it keeps on going into a reboot loop, or it just will not fire up at all, chances are your SD card may need to be formatted and to start the process again. Now you can try and do the formatting, um, or the, sorry, the reset from the camera itself to see how you get on first of all, definitely worth trying. But if not, just remove the SD card, stick it into a computer, format the drive, or at least just look at the drive to see what the folder structure looks like. You should only have uh, three files, I believe. So that's a video file, a picture file, and like a text file, or something along those lines I'll put uh, pictures of it up in here anyway so you can see what it should look like and what it shouldn't look like. Hopefully those have been popping up already. So that's the best thing to do. Take the SD card out, format the card to its defaults. Uh, if need be, just rename the card if you want to so you know which one's which. Uh, I've named this one bad card so if it does happen again, I know it's actually the card which is doing it rather than the firmware. So hopefully this has been useful to some of you Xiaomi uh, Defang camera users. If you've liked this video, give it a like. If you disliked it, give it a dislike, but let me know in the comments what your problem is with the video or what the problem is with your camera, and I will try and help you out as much as I can. I've been Mike, this is Mike's Unboxing Reviews Now 2, and we'll catch you in the very next video. Thanks for watching.